When I lived here, in Paraguay, I smoked packs and packs of cigarettes. They, I don't know, helped me somehow. Now I only smoke to mark significant events in my life. I was born in a little hospital in Berlin in 1945, right as my father was losing the war. That's right. My father lost the war, so he must be a... My father never did anything unseemly in his entire life, except, of course, he conducted a series of experiments on Jewish prisoners at Auschwitz between the summer of 1942 and the autumn of 1944. I found out about my father in Paraguay at 17. It was my best friend who told me about my father's work. Not that I believed him at first. I remember he was on the front lawn, kneeling down, looking at the grass. He asked me how my school day was. I asked him how he liked it at Auschwitz. I called him a murderer. He told me not to raise my voice. I wondered if my whole life was going to be like this. A sort of doomed flight. And that's when I met her. Sarah Kleinman. Sarah was Jewish. Her mother was deported to Auschwitz in September 1943. I was in love with her. 